Right, we are live. Hello, everybody. This is our Prophet for God one coming at you with another brief and detailed video. Today, we're going to be talking about Donald Trump and something I said a few years ago. I said regarding a man that's going to be coming and his heart was going to be full of the devil. And um, I, t I also said in, in, in the comment section of how this man is not going to be the Antichrist, but he's going to be a front runner for the Antichrist. And Donald Trump, um, all of something, is the front runner of the Republican Party. And this is what I've been seeing. The Lord has showed me this in the vision that uh, a man that's going to be coming in 2016 and his heart was going to be full of the devil. It's going to be full of the devil, but he will not be the Antichrist, but he will be the front runner of the Antichrist. But um, I also, uh, I also uh, uh, said um, in my comment section that the day of doom is coming because we all know that the Antichrist will be the son of doom or the son of prevention. And he's going to be that wicked one that's going to be revealed in the end times. And um, today I'm going to be talking about what Trump uh, showed up in Alabama and had a lot of supporters that followed him. And um, Trump said some some things um, in his speech that was so disturbing. The first one said uh, uh, he, he compared himself to Billy Graham. That's the first thing. Because we all know that Billy Graham is not a racist uh, preacher. He's not racist. And Trump is racist because he plans on sending, when he gets elected, sending all uh, Mexican immigrants back to Mexico. And um, he plans on doing that. And um, um, I was wondering, I said, how is Trump going to send all the Mexicans back to, to Mexico? That's the question. And then the second thing is, he says uh, the Bible is his favorite book. The Bible is his favorite, favorite book. I say, OK, if the Bible is your favorite book, why ain't you living by what the Bible says? And how can you be? A, uh, how can the Bible be your favorite book when you're not even a believer in Christ Jesus? And then the final part is. All the racist Christians who are not really Christians, because I'm going to tell you something, God does not deal with racism. And, 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 then, and, and then there's a scripture for that also in the Bible and, and what is written in scripture about haters. Haters are really racist people. And the Bible also records that if if a if a homosexual or adulterer can't get in. Uh, what makes you think that a racist person is going to go to heaven when he has hate in his heart for or, or, or when he hates somebody for the color of his skin? And I'm going to show you all a video that's going to be so disturbing. It's going to be Donald Trump and his speech, and, and it's going to be a person in the crowd that chants white power. This is what I've seen in the spirit of God. And this is how I know that Christians and believers are not to be deceived by the man's words. Now, pretty sure all the racist people will be in Alabama because parts of Alabama is racist. Parts of the South are still racist. So this is what I've seen in the spirit of God about 2016. And um, it wasn't until Obama got, in, um, got to be president is when all this racial tension started. And really, this is just a setup by the devil to try to get this country divided. You see, I'm gonna you, you see, right now, um, I'm not a, a, a supporter of Obama. Uh, I don't hate Obama, but I just don't like what Obama put into place. And he wrote homosexuality in into law, uh, gay marriage. But um, we're gonna talk about on, that, that on another subject. But now we're talking about Trump today. And I've seen this. And I seen this in the vision in 2016. Uh, this is what's going to happen. The day of doom is coming for America because, number one, because of the evilness and the wickedness that is going on in this country. America is, uh, is already in trouble. They already in trouble. The wrath of God is going to be poured out on this nation because of the wickedness that is going on. And what's happening now is the devil is setting this up. 
for the uh, the Antichrist to come on the scene. The, 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 this is this is just getting started. So let me show you this video for a minute. I'm gonna show you this video. Do you agree with me? Yes, yeah, serious. I can see it. Anybody with a sign that big has to agree. So, so. Now, did you hear that? Now, now, did you hear that? At the end of this video, you heard white power. You heard white power. You heard white power. White power. White power. White power. So, what is the what is this telling everybody? This is telling me that there's going to be a problem because now all the racist people are flocking to this man and all the racist Christians are flocking to this man if though he's some type of God. And this one lady who she was holding the sign up and she said, thank God for Trump. Now, number one, um, the real Christians worship God. And him alone shall we worship. This guy Trump is going to be a danger to America. And when he gets in, he is going to be the doom in America. Oh, America, a dark day is coming. And I'm going to tell you something. Because of the wickedness in this world, America is already in trouble. They're already in trouble. These people are going to make it ten times more worse. Because, number one, when Jesus gets back... What makes you think that he's not going to deal with the homosexual? That he's not going to deal with the uh, adulterer? <laughs> what makes you think that he's going to excuse the racism in your heart? No sin is going to enter into heaven. Jesus is coming back for a church without spot or wrinkle. So let's listen to this video again. I'm, I'm going to let y'all listen to it. I'm may, I may play it a few times. I can see it. Anybody with a sign that big has to agree. So... Let, now, let's play that again. Do you agree with me? Yes, serious. I can see it. Anybody with a sign that big has to agree. So, so. Now, you, now, you heard white power. And this is the same thing I've seen. Number one, the devil is really trying to set this stuff up for the Antichrist. And Trump, just like I said in my comment section, he's going to be a front runner for the Antichrist. And I'm trying to tell you, nobody knows who the Antichrist is, but it's coming. The day of doom is coming for America. All right, that is the end of my video. So uh, everybody have a blessed day.